A huge investment in the mines are beginning to pay off as most Zambians have been lobbying. This comes as First Quanta Mining is this week paying tax arrears owed to the Zambian government from the year 2008 to date. The arrears were as a result of disputes between the state and the mining company of adjustments in the national mining tax policy. A total of $224 million is being remitted to National Treasury accounting for export levy, win for tax, minority as well as income and corporate tax provisions indicated in the mining tax policy. Finance and National Planning Minister Dr. Stumbekom Sokotwani has confirmed the payment of the arrears to journalists in Lusaka. Next, I expect very good taxes from... Uh uh, Lumana. So, mine by mine, as their individual situations change, you see, and eventually, as I have always said, roughly about one third of all the taxes in this country will come from mining sector. And Dr. Msokotwane says the payment will assist social sectors and key areas like infrastructure that are top on government projects. This money that is coming now, this is the money that is going to go to infrastructure. This infrastructure, today as we are speaking, Cobra Belt roads are being done. Cabo roads are being done. Osaka roads are being done. Uh, so what's the meaning of equity? Beyond that, we have a situation whereby in every province today, there is major infrastructure going on. Uh, in southern province, we have just spent a lot of money on the Namala Choma road to finish it. The minister says First Quantum remains a large taxpayer and more mining firms will fall into this bracket, especially with Lumana expected to increase its output in the next two years.